Hey, what's up? This is Scott with Level Up Tuts, and today we're going to be talking about toast messages. And a toast message is really just a simple notification pop-up message, and it's only going to display for a certain amount of time and then fades away. So toast messages can be used as maybe just a really simple sort of, um, you know, test to make sure something's working, or that you could just find all sorts of situations in which they'd be useful and you want to check out something. So let's say we want to, you know, this button isn't giving us, it's not doing anything when we press it, and we want to make sure that the button is even, you know, registering a press. So one thing we can do is down here in our onclick method, we can, first thing, we can add a toast dot make text, and we're going to let this autocomplete here. So the context is going to be get application context, okay? And this is going to get the application's context and use that. And the text in here is going to be the text we want in our, our button. So we're just going to say uh, it works. Um, or maybe we'll say button click works, just to be a little bit more description. And this duration could be long or short, so we want this to be toast dot length, and then let it fill in the rest for us, length long, just so we have it display long for us. And then after this parenthesis here, we're just going to say dot show parentheses, and then semicolon to finish it off. So this is going to run the make text method of toast and it's going to do that and display this button click works once this button has been clicked. So let's run up our application here and we can see that in action. Okay so here's our app and now when I click this press me we should see this button click works and this is just a notification it just comes up for a brief period of time and then leaves us we'll click it again and you notice every time we click it's going to tell us that this button click worked and so you can even use these to let your users know uh you know maybe something happened uh, i wouldn't overdo it with them maybe uh you'll see them occasionally in android if you're a user of android but it's nice to know that you can output something on the screen when you're testing. And in future lessons, we're going to go over uh, other debugging tools like, you know, log notifications and stuff like that. So that's nothing crazy, but keep in mind you can also put in your variables as long as they're strings into this string uh, spot right here, and it's going to output them in your toast message. So feel free to use those and let me know of all the creative ways that you're using your toast messages, uh, but you'll just notice that you're using them all the time. So check it out. This is a toast. And as always, if you have any questions or comments, leave a comment in the video or hit us up uh, in the comments. We're going to try to get to them as much as we can. And as always, thanks for watching. Bye.